Hi, my name is Gersant Singh. Today I'm going to be telling you about a great rifle match at the NRA Whittington Center in Raton, New Mexico. I'd like to encourage you all to come to this match next year. I had a really great time and it's a wonderful match. I used to be an active small bore rifle shooter about 40 years ago. You can see me here back in the 70s. And I met Lonis Wigger, who is a Olympic champion, and we used to shoot together back in the 70s. I met him at the Wildcat match here recently in March. So he invited me to his match there in Raton, New Mexico, there at the Whittington Center. And so I went, and I'm very happy that I did. So today I'll be showing you some slides and interviews with some of the match competitors there. And finally, we'll conclude the video with an interview with Lonis Wigger. So, okay, so let's go through these slides now. First, you can see this Whittington Center is a really great place. It's near Albuquerque, New Mexico. Well, a few hours away, actually. You can see here the uh, beginning of my trip where I left from California, and it took me about two days to get to Santa Fe. And this was on the Arizona-New Mexico border there. I have a little travel trailer and car. So it was a great trip. I stopped in Santa Fe there where they have beautiful hollyhock flowers and, and went on to the NRA Whittington Center here. You can see the front of it here. It's a beautiful place. The environment is full of wildlife. They have a wonderful facility there. I think this is one of the hidden secrets there in, in uh, New Mexico. You can see here are some of the other facilities here. A lot of open spaces. They get these thunderstorms coming in there every afternoon, which cool things off. They have great RV parking there. You can see this really spacious landscape. Just beautiful. A lot of wildlife. Here are some deer that I took pictures of just the first day that I arrived. The antelope there. Wonderful sunrises. This was just spectacular. This was from the door of my RV there, little trailer. And it's only $27 a night there at the RV camp. It's really very reasonable. This is their shotgun facility there. And they have a lot of uh, great displays and museum there, firearms museum, which I really encourage all of you to visit when you go to the match next year. They have very well laid out. I was very impressed with how they had all the different ranges for competitive shooters laid out. You can see these are more shots from the RV camp. This was a statue of Charlton Heston. He was the president of the NRA and he was in a movie there which depicted the settlers coming on the Santa Fe Trail. So they had put a statue there of him. The Santa Fe Trail has a long history of brave settlers coming out from Missouri to settle the West. And many argue that the firearms were an important part of this settlement. I think this is a really big part of American history, and everyone should really look at this museum they have there. They have all kinds of firearms from out from American history there in this museum. Really, really great display. Shows the courage and bravery of Americans and how they stood up for their rights. This is a Colt Peacemaker, which is one of the most famous revolvers there shows the sacrifice that Americans have made for our country. Now this shows where the rifle range is here from the entrance. Come up here on this road here where the arrow is, and it's just right here, the small bore range, where the uh, match was. They have many ranges there for high power shooting, pistol shooting. So this is a small bore range that we shot at there. The, Whittington Center. They even had a hummingbird there. Somebody put a... Now, 
There are many prizes that Lonus Wicker gave out. And it really added to the rifle match where he gave out all these prizes. And, uh, we're going to start out with the first. The first uh, Brit goes to. I'm not sure how you pronounce his name, but it's uh, Dave Perichadera. Firecracker 48. This was an interview I did here. Yes, that's right. Yeah, yeah. And uh, so, just talking to some of the uh, shooters here, and can you tell us why you came and tell us your name? And... Uh, my name is Justin Tracy, and uh, I moved out to Colorado Springs back in February. Close trip from I used to live up in New York, so this okay. would be a long trip then, but uh, yeah, less than three hours away. Oh, and great. So, it's a nice match for that. You know, we turn up, like, we don't know what you're running through. Yeah, yeah. So you've known, you known uh, Lone Sorger for a long time? A few years. I've been shooting on the long time. I've known for a few years. Okay. Yeah. Since uh -huh. Oh, great, great, great. And you do uh, mainly prong shooting or other positions? I do mostly prong. I do three positions, some, but uh -huh. uh, my kneeling's good my standing is. Okay. Things work. Okay. <laughs> work in progress. All right. All right. <laughs> and what can you tell us about the Firecracker 4800 that you like about it particularly? You've been here before. Uh, no, this is my first time. Oh, first time. Okay. Yeah, okay. first time is just I, I shot the Wildcats a couple of times. Okay, okay. But yeah, first time here, and um, it's a nice range, it's small, but it's in a great location, a beautiful area. Oh yeah, it's beautiful, yeah. And the That's conditions, good. from what I hear, tend to be very good here. She, yeah. The wind's definitely pick up now, but it's yeah. not bad, so. Yeah, yeah. So these, the these thunderstorms come in, come in yeah. Yeah. here and here. Yeah, as long as they come out from the shooting. Yeah, that's true, that's true, yeah. That's, oh, that's great, yeah, that's great. Okay, well, is there anything else you want to tell anybody about uh, why they should come, or? That's um, just a good time, and the people you meet, and everything is yeah. great. I mean, everyone's telling me, yeah. if you need anything, people will grab stuff out of the back, they have extra, yeah. extra site, yours breaks, here, use this one. Yeah, that's a really great point. Yeah. Even if you're the kind of person that can beat them, if you're an expert, mm -hmm. you can Possibly beat this person. They don't care. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's really a great group of people. Yeah, it just really is. Yeah, there's some really uh, uh, long time, really master shooters here in Lonsberger. Yeah. You know, uh, just um, nominated or actually was inducted into the um, the Olympic Hall of Fame. Right. Yeah. Yeah. So. Yeah. You're also yeah. Couple. Yeah. Yeah. That's right. So it's a good chance to shoot this. Top shooters. Yeah, we're at the Firecracker 4800, and uh, this is Nancy. And can you tell us why you're here, Nancy? Why are you? Yeah, or what, what, what do you like about the match? Let's oh, that. I love this match. It's put on by Wake, who's just amazing, and he's done just about anything you can do in small work shooting. And okay. She's won Olympic medals. And mm -hmm. She puts on a good match. She makes it fun. Everybody comes here and has a good time. The weather's mm -hmm. amazing here, usually. It's a little windy sometimes, but. Yeah. Yeah. It seems like a really beautiful place. This is yeah. the first time I've been here. Oh, yeah. 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 No, it's, it's gorgeous. I love yeah. the animals. The wildlife here is great. Mm -hmm. yeah. And everybody just has a fun time together. Yeah. There's some of the uh, country's top shooters here, so it's a good opportunity for, you know, young juniors or anybody who would like to maybe shoot with some really top competitors to be able to learn from them and things like that, too, I think. Yeah, you, you have... Olympic shooters here, and national team shooters, and mm -hmm. you know people that have just been shooting forever that are really good at it. Yeah, so, yeah that's good. It's a good place to come and you know watch some really good targets. Mm -hmm. People are nice. So. Yeah, yeah, that's the best thing. That's the best part. That's why Yeah, it's a relaxed match. People are comfortable. It's not. There's no no big uh, pressure or anything. So if people have questions, they certainly can ask anybody and and uh, learn. I think learn a lot. You know, yeah, from being you can learn a lot. Yeah, no, that's great. That's it's, great. It, it's one of my favorite matches. Mm -hmm. And you were here last year, you said? Yeah, I've been here okay. five years ago. Oh, five years. Yeah. How long has the match been going on? Yeah. I don't know. Okay, at least five years. <laughs> okay. Yeah. okay, that's so, great. Yeah. I missed one year because I had to go to England. Well, that's not a bad thing, but uh -huh. I did miss that. Okay. But I, I think I've been here five years. Yeah, yeah. You? No. Five years. Okay.
Do you like Do you like the prize system, Wig's setup? These guys. Oh, the prize is amazing. Yeah. 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 You know, and if you look at the entry fee, you know, it might look a mm -hmm. little high, but it's not because they have to pay money, you know, a lot of money to the Wig Center. Yeah. But you know, I'm okay with that too because it's a big place and they have to keep it going somehow. Right. So it, you uh -huh. know, he always has prizes for everybody. Which, yeah, that's nice. Prizes are amazing. Yeah, prizes yeah. are great. Yeah. yeah, it's really great. I mean, they just gave away uh, two bricks of uh, uh, Lapua, Lapua yeah. ammo. So yeah. that's a that's a really good thing. And plus, a lot of other prizes too. So uh -huh. it seems like that's a really good deal. Yeah. Like yeah, he that. does a good job of getting sponsors. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's great. Which isn't always easy because yeah. I know a lot of the sponsors and they get like you know thousands. Well, hundreds of people every year asking for mm -hmm. stuff, so. Yeah, and you, you run the Wildcat match, right, Mark? Um, yeah, me and Ginger McLemore and uh -huh. some other people. Yeah. It's a lot of work, but it's worth it. And that's another good match, too, by the way. <laughs> okay, okay, thanks very much, Nancy. You're welcome. Okay, so we're here at the Fairgrounds Hall, and uh, we're going to have a little fun here. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Uh, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh, Nancy, can you introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Nancy Wilson. I'm the Wildcat Center Director. Yeah. Uh,
uh, like about the match and why people should come next year and what the good things are about it? Well, I've been shooting a long time. Uh, I guess I've been target shooting since about 1949. And uh, I love the sport. It's a lifetime sport. And it's probably been the big priority of my life, competitive shooting. And I wanted to see a match run where you get back good prizes to the entries. Because it's something that I always wished they could have done when I was in my prime. A lot of matches you go and compete in, you're lucky if you win a little medal hmm. for the whole, the whole competition. Yeah. And uh, I'm pretty well known throughout the uh, shooting world, so I attend the SHOT Show every year in Las Vegas, and I go and find sponsors. Okay and uh, ask them to donate prizes for my competitions. And I, uh, I get prizes for the Western Wildcat, which is held in Phoenix in March every year, and it's a four-day prone match. Mm -hmm. My four-day prone match here in July, and also the Sportsman's Team Challenge Regional, which I run here in May. And so I actually collect prizes for three different competitions. Correct. And I, any, any given year, I've got 35 to 40 sponsors. And they give us some pretty nice stuff. Yeah, I really noticed it. And uh, stuff, yeah. Smith and Wesson has given me three firearms for every competition that I've ever run. Great. Now going on ten years. Great! Wow. That's and, great. and that's a pretty darn nice prize to give yeah. out to people. Yeah, exactly. So I kind of run it because I enjoy seeing the people and the kids come in mm -hmm. and compete. Mm -hmm and enjoy themselves right and then have a nice prize table at the end yeah and, you know there's a lot of kids here today that right would never win anything yeah they got a chance right. to go up to the prize table and pick something out yes that's and right. uh, in a lot of cases they got some pretty nice awards yeah yeah and that's uh, so that's one of the great things about this match is the the prizes that oh yeah out. right it, and you won't find it anywhere else right exactly yeah and i noticed it was really great how many juniors came and this this is like the only match where um, they can come and feel comfortable talking to Olympic champions and where else are you going to be able to talk to uh, many time Olympic champions? Well, I try to get the best shooters yeah. in the country to come. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, I usually have some come with the marksmanship unit in Fort Benning. Mm -hmm. I get resident athletes out of the USA shooting team in Colorado Springs. Right. And some other top shooters in, in the country too come in. Mm -hmm. We had eight or ten of the real top fine shooters here for this competition. Yeah. I'd like to have 30 of them if I could get them. Sure, sure. Because I want the good shooters to be here. I want the competition. Right, and, uh, right. Yeah. I, I just enjoy I'm getting long in the tooth here. I don't know how much longer I'm going to Go ahead. <laughs> but yeah. uh, I really do enjoy putting on the match and, and, mm -hmm. and you know, getting together with everybody and the social, social yeah. socialization that you have with them. Oh, sure. And, uh, yeah, the really nice people uh, here. Yes, they And are. the facilities here are great, too. Great right? facility. Yeah, great. Uh, we have a really nice range. Mm -hmm. uh, we're trying to raise money to build a new stat office mm -hmm. out there on the range. Yep. And uh, uh, we're getting close to the money right. today, right. talking, and, and uh, I think we're going to be able to do it. Hopefully, we're going to have a new stat office next year. Yeah, oh, that's great. That's really great. I think that um, when I was a junior back in 1972, when I went to Fort Benning, Georgia, uh, to be there on a scholarship, I was really impressed with how um, you and the Army Marksmanship Training Unit um, helped juniors. And I think that is really reflected here in this match as well. And I'd really like to um, say to all juniors who want to learn more and to uh, compete, to come to this match. I, I think it's a really good opportunity. We really like to have them. Yeah. When I was in the military, we did a lot of clinics in high schools and colleges right. all over the country, yeah. trying to get the kids started the proper way in their positions yeah. and so on. Yeah. And uh, to improve marksmanship throughout the country, mm -hmm. you know, so eventually some of them will go to our international right. uh, games and, yeah. and compete. We've yeah. had a number of them do that from the programs. Yeah. And I think shooting really creates discipline, self-confidence, yeah. all of these things that really, I think, are really necessary, needed in our society right now, too. too. And uh, uh, well, you find work. working with kids that uh, you work with 35 or 40, maybe you'll have one or two that comes out of it that really wants to be competitive mm -hmm. and has a desire to go on. Yeah. It, it takes that desire. You learn, uh, you learn a lot of things from the, yeah. from the sport. Yeah. The things that you use the rest of your life. Yeah, it, right. That's exactly right. I, I found that to be true yeah. as well. Yeah. Well, thank you for your time, and I hope you all come to the Firecracker 4800 next year. And 
Raton, New Mexico, there at the Whittington Center.